Hi there, I'm Jerry Katz, the Coleman Professor of Entrepreneurship at St. Louis University in St. Louis in the USA. I came here today to take a couple minutes and talk to you about painstorming. Uh, painstorming is a technique that you would typically use in a classroom or in a training situation. The target audience for painstorming can be students, it can be current or potential entrepreneurs, or people who are exploring uh, the entrepreneurial opportunity space. The goal of painstorming is pedagogical, but as you'll see in a minute, there also can be an economic aspect to it. Painstorming itself is actually something you probably already know how to do. Think about brainstorming. In brainstorming, what you do is pose an opportunity, a situation to people and say, tell me what you think about this. Give me your ideas about this. And you start to solicit the ideas from the participants. You let everyone speak. If one person's idea helps another person to think of an idea, you write that down. You're writing down everything everyone says. You don't let people take time to think about it. You don't let people take time to give feedback on it. That's for another time. Just give me your ideas. Painstorming is exactly like that, with one exception at the beginning. Instead of giving them the idea and saying, what, uh, uh, what do you think about it? Say, here is a situation. What pains do you feel? You're, uh, you're opening up a ketchup bottle. What pains do you have getting ketchup out of the bottle? You're trying to get to your bank and out quickly. What pains do you have when you are at the bank? And let people talk about the pains they have. Let everyone build off of one another. It works exactly the same as brainstorming, but the focus is on pain. Why pain? Because pain gives you the pathway to opportunity. For us, opportunity comes from finding a way to solve the pain. The beauty of that, from the lean startup mentality, is it gives us an approach that has a customer focus from the very beginning. This idea is actually uh, comes to me, I'm in a business school, from a professor, a colleague of mine named Sridhar Condor, who's in the engineering school. And they use painstorming to help identify the kind of engineering problems that are the best to put their energy into. I found it works tremendously well in all kinds of businesses and with entrepreneurs at all levels of expertise and experience. Thanks for listening. I'm Jerry Katz.